Hi everybody. Welcome back. It's Pokemon time. <laughs> Let's get that going. Whoa, big. Let's fix that. There we go. <laughs> Should get about an hour this time. Last time I streamed this, it was only about a half hour, so it should be double the length. I ended up getting sucked into Outer Wilds for longer than I expected. <laughs> I was hoping to do two hours of this, but one hour will be fine. Yep, Sasha, it's Pokemon. I wonder if those trees flashing like that is in the original, or if that's an emulation error. I mean... An error with with my Game Boy Advance console that I'm uh, playing this on right now. <laughs> um, so I think at the moment I was gonna go in this cave. So what Pokemon do I want to be training? Probably Poot. Probably Taylo, because Taylo I intend to like use. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use Puccina. Also I should probably go to a Pokemon Center actually. Come to think of it. That would probably be a good use of my time at the moment. There's a bug in the grass. Look chat, there's a bug in there. There's a big old bug in there. Big old buggy guy. Hey everybody, it's Poochie Ina. <laughs> Back at it again with Poochie Ina. So how many people here like bugs? I like bugs. Bugs are pretty cool in my opinion. <laughs> Chan likes bugs. They're just little, little guys. Bugs is just little dudes. <laughs> They is they small. S M O L. That's every bug in the world. I'll try and catch an abra just for the heck of it. You gotta catch it immediately. It's the only way. Probably should buy more Pokeballs soon. Hey, I got it. I don't find any bugs. I don't find any animals scary, to be honest. Unless they can, like, actually do harm to me. At which point I'm still not scared of them. I just, like, give them respectful distance. <laughs> a Pokemon that sleeps 18 hours a day. Observation revealed that it uses teleport to change location once every hour. Wow. can't trade Pokemon, so... In this playthrough, Sir Gardevoir is a better choice for my Psychic type. Also, my controller has decided that now is the time to run out of battery. So, let me go fix that. Be right back, everybody. I'll be back in one moment. Gotta put new batteries in this. <laughs> Do not lick the poison newt, Sasha! <laughs> okay, be right back one sec.
All right, I've got batteries. Did I say for my controller? I mean for my for my legitimate Game Boy Advance system. That's what I meant. Just running low on batteries. <laughs> I've got a grow vial now. Whew. I'm going over here because it looks like my berries have grown. I get that before I forget. I mentioned that, the Game Boy Player, Shan, I mentioned that earlier on my stream today, actually, coincidentally. My April Fool's Day goof. I've been using a Wii rather than an actual GameCube to play GameCube stuff, so... I can do that. One of the, well, one of the main reasons I got a Wii instead of a GameCube is that the cables for uh, GameCubes are really, really expensive. But the cables for Wiis are not. Wiis are, like, really inexpensive. GameCubes are very expensive. So it just made sense to get a Wii. Because <laughs> I do have a GameCube controller. I got it. I got my GameCube controller when they uh, started making them again for Smash Bros. Ultimate. That one when those came out. It's just a real original GameCube controller, but uh, manufactured in what 2018. <laughs> there he is. He's got a Puchina. Somebody else has to fight Puchina. They didn't give you your exact controller back, Shan? That's not very nice. Is Bug good against Dark? Well, let's find out. Yes, it is. That's that weird. That's a weird type matchup that I. I have difficulty remembering for whatever reason. I may have to switch Grovile out just because the accuracy is too terrible. Oh no, we're good. Need something with 100% accuracy. Does have a yeah, that has good act. There we go. I cut the poochie. <laughs> Without a lizard. My career in crime comes to a dead end. Boss told me this would be a slick and easy job to pull. Devon Goods. It's a Wingle. Pico. Mr. Briny? Sounds like a joke name. I wonder when I can run into Trap Inch. This Flygon would be a good Pokemon to end up with. Eventually. I may want to go for Flygon and Altaria. 
That might be a good team. I'm gonna buy Pokeballs. Let me get back to town. If anybody wants to look up where Trapinch is in Pokemon Emerald, that'd be cool. And also where Swablu is, to see if those are viable for my team. Like, are they gonna get- am I gonna get those soon? You know where it is in Sapphire. Yeah, Emerald's gonna be a little bit different, probably. I got another great ball. This reminds me of something funny. Hold on a sec. This image. Remember this? <laughs> you got two great balls. <laughs> oh. President's office is on this floor. To the shipyard and slate port. Walk animations. Really something. It's like I'm talking to the principal or something. This looks so plain and goofy. <laughs> I forgot about how simple these games used to look. <laughs> There's like nothing special about this guy. And his chair and everything. This is so funny looking. <laughs> I love it. Deliver a letter to Stephen and Duford. Pokenav. Map of the Hoenn region. to du Duford and Slateport. Condition? Wow. They have nothing. They're not cool, they're not cool, tough, beautiful, smart, or cute. None of them are. Well then what are they? Shin. Burden Turf, Lava Ridge, Oliver, I don't remember that one. Middleburg, Old Ale, or Sleepport. I remember Maville. I think the remakes had new Maville. I have a while to go. Okay. Duford. So we gotta go to Slateport first. 16. I think I have to go north first. 
I can't go through Route 116 yet. Time to leave. That tiny collection. Like two of them. You only have two? Is that really a collection yet? These people are pretty useless. Trying to make stuff, but they're not making progress. Isn't that a thing in black and white, though? Apparently he succeeded by then. Nobody's having any luck with the things they're trying to make. Oh, this guy... This guy's got it. <laughs> Let's get a move on. Let's go buy some Pokeballs. What the heck was that sound? Match call. Please give our president a call. <laughs> it opens the menu so that I can try it immediately. Pokemon must be working properly. Incredible. <laughs> what a video game. Alright, where's the store? Does the stream look good, by the way? No screen tearing? It always is on my end, though, so it's hard to tell. Just go ahead and get ten of those. Shroomish. Such jazzy music, dude. Brendan. You want to play this Pokemon, but you do not know how to on a totally legit gameplay? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I could send you this one that I have, Sasha. I just happen to have it. <laughs> I know those are hard to come by nowadays, but... Just happen to have it. be normal effectiveness? Yeah. However, I have a move that'll be super effective, which I should use. This one. Almost got him. Quick attack should do it. There we go. Get out of town. Poor chick, huh? Yours hasn't even evolved, huh?
thinking about this. Bug type, but it has poison sting. I don't have a good matchup for fire type yet. I've got to get Pizza Head needs to learn some water moves. Pizza Head really needs to, to learn some water moves. It will be effective. I'm gonna throw Taylo in for the level ups. for Torchic was great! Did you see that? <laughs> I'm planning to rep hopefully replace Talo with uh, Swablu. And then uh, I'm not going to keep Cascoon. That'll probably get replaced with uh, Flygon. Otherwise, my team is pretty much done. And it depends on how it goes with Lotad. I might need a different water type. Because water is important to have. And Flygon will have me covered for like ground and rock stuff. Plus it's, oh, I'm yawning. <laughs> Plus it's a dragon, and dragon is good. Especially in these earlier generations. Resists a lot. Ideally, I would have Metagross, but the catch rate on those is so ridiculously low, I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> Forget it. See if I can get it with Confusion. I know it's a bit higher level than I am, so it might not live very well. But I would love to confuse it. Mm, nope. No such luck. All right, Grovel. Revile. Really? You have a super effective move and you're just going to scratch me? Really? This is your... This is what you're going to do? Really? Why did it never use Ember? But it, at the rate I was going, it could have killed me with Ember. Absol's not as fluffy as Mighty Ena, though. Chan. <laughs> Which is what I'm planning to have. This one's a great sailor. That way his name is Briny. There's Brian. No, I don't... No. No more talking. There. I'm planning to train Mighty Ina. So we've seen uh, Poochie Ina. What does a Mighty Ina look like? What is mighty, Ina? <laughs> A save. Alright, time to go north. Westboro City. Okay, we haven't been this way yet. I got a super potion. I don't remember what team I went with in uh, Alpha Sapphire. Oh, you can't keep going north. Where the hell am I supposed to go?
I think I had Glalie. I think I remember having Glalie because they added a new Mega Evolution for Glalie. And I remember using that. I don't usually use Ice types on my teams. I should probably really get myself a fire type at some point, but I don't know what it will be. When I run into a good fire type, I'll take it. <laughs> Basically. It's gonna be hard to come up with what my team's gonna be in this. Can't go that way. I don't have rock smash. Guess we go back south. Sad. Hmm. But, like, who would I replace with a fire type is the question. Like, I guess. Like, I guess my idea. I really wish that uh, there was Houndoom. Because Houndoom could be my dark type and my fire type. I'd be down for Houndoom if that was in this game. Sometimes change in the way it looks. I would be shocked. <laughs> Route 104. Yeah, I've been here before. Oh yeah, you can't walk through there. These little puddles were not in fire red and leaf green. Unique to uh, Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. Let's see. I've been to Petalburg. And I've been to Old Ale and Little Root. Guess we're going this way, huh? I forget how you go around in this world. Or in this region, I guess I should say. <laughs> it's time for Pokemon battle. I have a lot of money. Okay. <laughs> oh man, look at this doofus. Winston. It would be nice to have a fighting type as well. They, like, there's so many types I want to have. It's hard to pick. Hello, welcome to stream. Why couldn't I win? Because you only have a zigzagoon, dingus. After all, I have plenty of money. <laughs> he knows he is going to have to pay people because he loses. <laughs> Trap Inch is Route 111 and Mirage Tower. Yeah, I was asking about Trap Inch earlier. How far do I have to go for those? I don't know Hoenn very well. That's oh, up here. It's not too long. That's where we're going. I want to get Swablu as well. And we didn't go this way before. One blue the bird, yeah. It evolves into Altaria, <laughs> which is the real Pokemon that I want. Oops, be you. Miracle Seed. 
That makes grass type moves stronger, right? Yep. Well, I always just give that to my grass starter. <laughs> It's funny to remember that this is the first generation that had uh, held items. Hey Sasha, it's Wurmple! <laughs> Wurmple's here! Your favorite! Alright, let's see. Oh, this is the first one with abilities. Right. I played Generation 2, I should remember that. <laughs> Let's let you get some training, Puccina. Here's Taylor. I love an animation it has. Removing the day night cycle? And what? They kind of, they're kind of intermittent with their day night cycles in these games. Some of them have them, some of them don't. Oh, in this one. Looks like Mario bricks. Or Petalburg City. <laughs> Oops. Oh, hell yeah, C dot. I love that animation. <laughs> I don't need C dot, but I'll catch it. It's level three, it'll just get caught. Yeah, it's fine. It hangs off branches and absorbs nutrients. When it finishes eating, its body becomes so heavy that it drops to the ground with a thump. <laughs> Incredible. I wish those signs would tell me what's in the other direction. Yeah, I want to go to Old Ale Town. Yeah, old ale. Let's check out that map again. So yeah, I want to go north. Let's go for it. How convenient of them to give me the map now. Hey, there's Wingle. I don't think I'll use Wingle. I think I'd rather go for Altaria for my flying type. But it would perhaps be a better water type pick than uh, Lotad, considering I already have a grass type. Okay, fine, I'll attack you. Whenever I click out of the window, the game freaks out. I love the animation and sound effect for Water Gun in this generation. I try to keep my types down to one of each as best as I can. I don't have much reason to double up. I want to have as wide a range of types as I possibly can. Which is why I'm unsure about Lotad. <laughs> C 
save. I can't get through here either, can I? Can't go across the water yet. Wingle, please. I'm trying to explore. Leave me alone. Well, I can't go across the water, can I? That doesn't go through. 7.8 out of 10. Too much water. I went through here. I can't go this way because... I can't get through that tunnel. I couldn't go this way because... It was all downhill. I couldn't get past the... Maybe I missed something there. Maybe there is a way through. I'm gonna have to go with that. Because nothing else makes sense. I mean, coming back through here, I did get a few things, so... It wasn't a complete waste of time. If this is not the way I'm supposed to... Well, it doesn't seem to be the way I'm supposed to... It can't be the way I'm supposed to go, because... <laughs> you can't go through there! Hi, Ash. I'm lost. Oh, Mario! Wait, I already caught Mario. That's right. I saw I saw Mario last time. I played Alpha Sapphire, and this is the same general layout and progression as that game, generally speaking. Why did I step in that grass? How come I never caught Shroomish? I guess because I don't really need Shroomish. I love Shroomish, though. There we go. Dot has a much better animation, though. CDOT has the best animation in the game so far. I know in the, uh... The Generation 3 remakes of, uh... Oh! Well, there's a find! In the, uh, the Generation 3 remakes of Generation 1, they added a thing... They, they added a lava cookie under the truck, if you did the method that... Uh, you supposedly did to get Mew in the original. <laughs> the mythical Mew method gets you a lava cookie in the remake. You got slack off. Mythical Pokemon, uh, Ash, are the ones that are, like, event legendaries. Technically, they're actually called Mythical Pokemon. Legendary Pokemon are the ones that you catch in the game normally, and Mythical Pokemon are the ones you have to get through an event. <laughs> or at least that they were originally from an event. Because Arceus is probably in... Pokemon Legends, presumably. 
they wouldn't name the game after it and not have it in there. I don't think. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's as simple as that. Really regretting having come back through this forest. Because I have to deal with this. I mean, I did catch a couple Pokemon. But, uh... Really would just have preferred not to be here. <laughs> TBH. Oh, we didn't fight this person yet, huh? Last Haley. Oh boy, it's our friend Lo Pizza Head. You've never played Ruby or Sapphire or Emerald? Oh, I see. <laughs> Alpha Sapphire was my least played Pokemon game. I played it for like 26 hours, which sounds like a lot, but like that's nothing compared to how long I've spent playing other Pokemon games. I pretty much just beat the game and that was it. Probably not gonna even. He's probably growled at me too much. Can't quite kill. Oh, but all I can do to me is that. You're just delaying the inevitable there, Lotad. Also, somebody tried to convince me that... Um, that uh, Lotad did not have six legs. It was four legs, and then it has a tail. But I could have sworn it's got six. And I was right. There's, uh, there's official art that confirms the six, the six legs of Lotad. See? It's got six legs confirmed. I, <laughs> I knew what I was talking about. And would I suggest Emerald or the remakes? Uh, I haven't played enough of this game yet. And I know I didn't really care for the, the remakes. Lotad confirmed bug, yes. <laughs> I think you really just leveled up. Here, put you in, I'll get you some more experience. I'm look I'm still looking forward to the Gen 4 remakes just because uh, I never got to play Generation 4 when it was new. Also, never mind on that, I forgot that he got growled at a billion times. <laughs> really, I'm really I'm weak to grass pretty strong right now. Pretty strongly, so... Oh, actually, I do have a Flying-type move. I forgot that Taylor had Peck. So Taylor was a good pick. There we go. I shouldn't have battled. Perhaps you shouldn't have. <laughs> Dense graphics. North has to be the way to go for to go forward from here. There's no other choices. Hey, there you go. 
I have to have just missed something here, right? No, I didn't. Uh... I'm so confused. I figured I must have just missed something here because... I can't go east. There's a tunnel in the way I can't go through. I can't go south because I run into water whichever way I go. And I can't go north because it's blocked off by uh, little ledges that I can't climb. Because I am a baby. <laughs> I'm a tiny chibi baby. Well, I can go in here now. Let's check this out first. I'm not ready to give in and take your advice just yet. Not ready to take the spoiler just yet. You can, to get to Verdant Turf without using this tunnel, you'd have to cross the sea to do for its sail onto Slateport and travel through Mauville. I've seen I've seen them on the map already. Ash. So I have heard of them. <laughs> Lots of whismers in this cave. I guess that's why they're trying to be quiet, huh? Because it's whismers. <laughs> they don't want them to. Get, they don't want to get yelled at by whismer. Puchina. Okay, there is something going on here. Boy, the Wismers just don't quit. Anything else? <laughs> There's too many Whismers in this cave! <laughs> Stop it! Get out of here! Oh my god! <laughs> Whismer! Please! There we go. <laughs> okay, let's let's see what what his directions were again. Go to Duford, Slateport, Mauville. Although I can't, right? Because Duford is north, right? No, it's not. Duford is. Uford is down there. Is there a way to just go south from the town? Is there a boat I get on? Maybe there's just a boat I get on. I think I remember a boat. I thought going. S hmm. Think about this. I don't think I needed to do this, but 
I guess it's fine, huh? <laughs> I love how no attempt was made to make it look like they're even remotely actually sitting on this. It looks more like she's like laying on it sideways. Or standing like right next to it. The seat... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no attempt was made to make these seats make sense with uh, <laughs> let the sprites in this game work. <laughs> Very good. Well, if I just go here... Well, going south brings you to the forest. It doesn't even match the map. Actually, yes it does. I don't want to go through the forest again. Do I have to go through the forest again? Can you confirm that for me? Do I have to go back down through the forest? To get where I need to go. Because I don't want to go through there unless I have to. <laughs> okay, I do. I don't know why I went into this grass. There's nothing for me here but pain. And wasted time. The guy did tell me to cross the sea to Duford. <laughs> the crying Miyamoto is here. Thank you, Ash. Did Miyamoto cry when they took, uh... They took down uh, those Mario games? Can you do that for me, Miyamoto? Can you, can you do that thing? Can you crawl around on the floor and cry real loud? Crawl around on the floor and cry like a little baby. Okay, I'm stuck at the ocean. go back to to little root he was the evil man who organized it <laughs> okay Miyamoto crawl around and cry like a little baby be less happy more sad <laughs> for the moment, Shan. I got the hint I asked for. This is gonna take a while, but I want Puccini to get all the experience. Sorry for the horrible noises, but I'm like clicking on other, land on other windows. Here, I'll play the video I was quoting. Start making your noise. Start making your noise. Start making your noise. Roll around on the floor and make your noise, Alden. Can you make your noise? Alden, if you could start crawling on the floor and making some noise, that would be so beautiful. Cry for me. Crawl on the floor and cry like a little baby. Can you do that, Alden? Crawl around and crawl like a baby. Alden, do that thing. That would be so beautiful. That's great, like that. <laughs> <laughs> crawl around on the floor and cry like a little baby. Aha! 
A boat. This must be it. Yeah, Mr. Brainy. There we go. Oh, this is a hell of a thing. Oh my god. It's windy wherever you are. The speed. Oh my god. Yeah, I found Pico. There we go. If it landed Duford. Duford. Thanks for just randomly giving me something, stranger. Well, it's time to level up Talo and, uh, Ralts. Raleigh's fighting type, I believe. If I recall correctly. I didn't need to heal my Pokemon, did I? Or maybe I did? I, oh yeah, I used some moves on Magikarp, didn't I? Yeah, Ralts and Taylor need to level up a lot. I'm probably not going to beat a gym today. Because I only wanted to stream about an hour. Because Outer Wilds went late. So I got really into it. This is a tiny island, isn't it? Zigzagoon? It's a funny looking little sprite. <laughs> Alright, I've got a fishing rod now. But it's the old rod that can only catch Magikarp. I can always go with Gyarados as my flying type, but... Eh, I don't know. All the Pokemon I have are Generation 3, aren't they? Yeah, this is a whole, a full Generation 3 team. <laughs> Fast shopping. No. What's new and what's in? All right, we got to do the funniest thing that we can with these with these words. I'm tempted to make date something. Oh, this will work. <laughs> Sports bug! Yeah, I knew that. Knew it all along. Of course I know about that. Sports bug, right? Isn't sports bug the coolest or what? The hippest thing in hip. You'd think I'd not know about it? <laughs> Fast shopping, it's like so five minutes ago. Now sports bug is what's vital and in tune with the times. Yeah, sports bug. Spell out cry like baby. Can I do that? I'm 
not sure that I can. All right. I think I could I could write cry baby perhaps. Mm, no, the word cry isn't here. No, the, I don't think I can. Has to be sports. <laughs> sports flag. Uh, no. Teaching my Pokemon about sports bug. Somebody has. I want to. I want somebody to draw the sports bug. Sports bug. Isn't there a TV show on it? I wanted to look at the TV and say it was a program about sports bug. Sports bug scream. Is sports bug even more? <laughs> what have I done? Identifying good sports bug and bad sports bug. The link between sports bug and Pokemon. Useful sports bug. It's neatly jammed with books about sports bug. How did this happen? I collect official sports bug licensed merchandise. Sports bug brand clothing. I. <laughs> it looks like a sports car, but it has a bug face. Look up the Yu-Gi-Oh card giant ballpark. That looks like a sports bug, you're right. You're right, there's the sports bug. You found it. <laughs> I love it. Those are multiple sports bugs. Like the coolest thing going. This game is incredible. I can't believe sports bug was really that popular. What are you talking about, buddy? It's tentacool. Same type attack. Same type attack bonus. So I'll go for peck. Please do not poison. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Ooh. Two level ups. It was worth the poison. level up Ralts a bit. Yeah, in this generation, the poison can hurt you uh, outside of battle. When did they stop having that happen? Because I know that was, like, a slightly major thing. When they stopped having poison affects you outside of battle. I just don't remember when that happened exactly. Generation 5. I was gonna say 5, but I wasn't sure. 
I did know that by gen I think by generation six I remembered it not happening. Should prefer fishing in the sea or a stream? Well, I'm fishing on a stream, right? If I fish, I'll be fishing on a stream. <laughs> oh boy! Magikarp. Outside of battle, I'm talking about Ash. Like when you're walking around and you get hurt by poison. They stopped doing that in later generations. Get out of here, tentacle. It doesn't. Let's look this up. Pokemon poison outside of battle. Poison status condition. Boy, when I click out of this window, it really scrambles the game, doesn't it? Generation 2, Generation 3. Generation 5, outside of battle, all poison Pokemon in the par player's party lose 1 HP every 4 steps the player takes. So Generation 5, they didn't get rid of it yet. Generation 4 onward, poison Pokemon take double damage, blah blah blah. So Generation 6, you no longer take damage outside of battle. So I was right with 6. No, I guess poison is the only status condition to have an effect outside of battle. However, from generation 5 onward, it no longer has an effect outside of battle either. Well, what the heck did I just read up there then? Let me reread that. Oh, okay, yeah, generation 5. Poison Pokemon no longer take poison damage outside of battle. I guess I just misread it. So, yeah, starting Generation 5 doesn't happen anymore. Let me close these windows. They are scrambling the game. <laughs> okay. Back to game. There we go. Became confused. Do 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 do. Else learned double team. Yeah, since, uh, since Generation 5, there's been no reason to immediately heal poison, though. <laughs> there, there you go. <laughs> and you didn't realize it, basically. <laughs> You can be leisurely with healing poison. Ha, I knew there must be an item there. That looks suspicious. 
Yeah, you can be leisurely with healing your Pokemon now. It's like with the the Pokemon things like that that I've had was not realizing that ice is good against ground until um, playing Pokemon Shuffle. It was giving me ice type Pokemon when I was uh, like, because you can press a button and it gives you Pokemon that are good against the Pokemon. Um, like, it'll just automatically give you ones that are good against it. And every time I would fight ground types, it was giving me ice types. And I was like, wait, what? And I was like, because I, I have most of the type matchups all memorized. And somehow I missed that one over all these years that I've been learning type matchups. And I had to look it up. I was like, has that always been a thing? And yes, it has since generation one. I don't know how I missed it. <laughs> And then, uh, more recently, I figured out that Bug is good against Dark. I somehow missed that one for years as well. There's a bra. Can't escape. Well, it's just gonna teleport. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> it wanted me to see it teleport. It's like, you're not getting away. No, you're gonna sit here, and you're gonna watch me leave. <laughs> You're gonna watch me leave. You don't get to leave. Lash. Sableye is in here? Sableye is pretty cool. I drew a Sableye recently. Okay, so that's what the progression lock is here. Makuhita. Hmm, I did mention I kind of want a fighting type. I'm not gonna really bother with him now, because I don't need fighting type right now. I'll catch him, and I might train him later. I'm just not sure where I'm gonna fit in a fighting type. Just fighting is a really useful type, because it's good against, you know, well, it's the only thing that's good against normal, for one thing, so it makes it kind of important. It's good against rock and steel. And dark. So. <laughs> Would Isabel have a Makuhita? I guess they are kind of similar, aren't they? Or is it Makuhita? I always say Hita. I guess it could be Makuhita. Most Pokemon don't have official pronunciations, though. So... Who knows? Your quaking rumbles in a cave. This is the sound of Makuhita undertaking strenuous training. I guess you could say however they pronounce it in the anime is the official pronunciation. But... <laughs> there you go. I don't know how consistent they are with that, you know? My cojita. Yeah, that's how I usually say it. I'm gonna check out the gym real quick before we... Uh, end the stream. Not gonna beat the gym, of course, but... I'm gonna check out how strong the gym is. Oh, it's dark! Dark as the ocean floor. I probably should save. I'd like to do at least one battle in here. That's some... <laughs> that's, that's some heckin' music. Heck of a song there. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that sprite. Floating. 
Level 13, huh? Thanks for that. Ralts is 100% going to be on my team the whole time, though, because it takes so much time to catch it. Wow, you didn't stay confused very long at all, did you? <laughs> Good! We can go for double team. Oh, yes! <laughs> I was hoping for that! What a good battle that was! Oh, it's kicked its butt. Didn't even take any damage. <laughs> Incredible. Well, that'll be the last battle for the stream. <laughs> This went a little bit longer than I was meaning to. But that's okay. Not too bad. So there you go. You would train at this gym, Shan? <laughs> In the dark? Wow, I really need to stop clicking out of the window when I'm streaming this. <laughs> Yeah, thank you everybody for watching. It seemed like everybody had a lot of fun. <laughs> um, so yeah, next week maybe it'll be a bit longer. I'll try to try to keep Outer Wilds down to two hours so that I can do two hours of Pokemon too. <laughs> um, and I still I still really want to do Rain World again soon with Cassie. That's that's. Still gotta still really wanna do that. I've still got a lot to go in Rain World as far as I'm aware, so <laughs> definitely wanna stream it more. Um at the end of the month, this month, the thirtieth is Pokemon Snap. New Pokemon Snap. Um so I'm looking forward to streaming that. I will stream it when it comes out. If not the day of, the next day. Depends on when it gets here. Um I think we're still doing Smash Bros. on Sundays for now. So you got that to look forward to this Sunday. Um, so yeah. I will see you again next week with this game. And I'll see you for a couple other things throughout the week. Oops, that's the wrong button. That's the right button. Okay. Bye-bye, <laughs> everybody. See you soon. Thanks for watching.